everybody, it's Deb from D&D &D Art Gallery. Today I have a 16 by 20 staple back canvas. I've prepared it with the um, Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White. And to that I've added about a half a tablespoon of Jewelescent Luster White uh, Mica Powder, just to give it a little bling. And I'm going to do a traveling open cup pour today. All my paints today, are um, the colored paints today I'm using are the Montmartre paints. And let me go over them with you. I have Montmartre Orange. And I have Montmartre Lemon Yellow. And I have Montmartre Purple. And I did add a little, a little dollop of black to that purple just to make it a little bit darker. I have Montmartre Deep Cyan Blue, Montmartre Viridian, and I have the Montmartre Scarlet. My pouring medium today is two parts Floetrol, one part paint, and I did add maybe a half a teaspoon of this uh, Golden Color Pouring Medium Gloss just because I had it and I thought why not give it a try and let's see consistency a little on the thinner side today leaves a little trace and then disappears right away and we can get started I'll put down a little puddle of my white here get my cup started And I may have to help that cup along. I've done that before. We'll just see how it goes. No particular order with adding these paints today. I really like doing this kind of pour. I think it's fun. Helping that cup down a little bit. And I may put something under my canvas just to pull it up a little bit to help that move. Add a little bit more white paint here. I hope you all are having a good day so far. Looks like it's moving pretty good so far. 
and I'm going to put some more of that white paint down just to help it along here. I'm going to give it a little bit of a tip here. And I may even pull my canvas up a little bit higher here. See if that helps. Looks like it, it may. See what color I want next. I don't know if I mentioned, but I did not add any silicone today. Gonna do a little tip again. Sometimes I really, really have to help the cup along, but today it seems to be going a lot better than other times. I'm hoping that means my paint is the right consistency for this kind of pour. And I have a little of that white left that I will add up here. A little bit of paint left. Okay.
Now I will just tip it here a little bit. Move the cup here a little bit. Okay. And I am going to use the rest of my white up here, I think, just to help the paint move. This the canvas is pretty well covered already. Okay, really looks interesting right now. And I'll do my tipping. And I'll try and keep you in frame as much as I can here. Go off that end and bring it back. And set it down a minute. I'm going to try and bring it down to this corner now and bring it back. And I am liking this color with that negative space and that lacing right there. So I'm going to try and try and keep that negative space there. And I'm going to tip down to this far corner now. And bring it back. Just going to take a look at it now. Let me check the sides here quick. When you when you're checking your corners and you have to add a little paint, try picking up that paint is that's similar to the color that your corner is so it's less less visible that you had to touch it up a little bit and I'm going to torch it now
Okay. And I think I'm just going to tip off a little bit yet down in this corner. And bring it back. And take another look. Yeah, I'm happier with that. And I'll clean off the bottom here. Again, this is a traveling open cup pour on a 16 by 20 inch canvas using the Montmartre paints, which I'm very happy with. It's a very, very colorful painting. And I am going to get you down for a close-up now. Okay, we have the upper left-hand corner here. Like the orange and the orange cells there and the red cells that popped up. Here's that, that negative space with the lacing that I wanted to keep right there. And I'll take you up the middle here very busy cells in here and I love that orange so pretty more lacing happy with the lacing and I'll take you over to the right hand corner here More lacing in here, lots of lacing in there. Very pretty. And some turquoise showed up here. The Viridan, it's called Virid Viridian. Viridian. That's the lower right hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it please to help my, my channel grow. Uh, ring the bell and choose all. So you'll be notified the next time that I do post a new video. And subscribe if you haven't. Until next time, take care everybody. Thank you for watching. Bye.